right, so who do we have in here? Oh, we got Sweet Tammy. Hi, how, are, how are you? What's up? Hey guys, we're in New Hampshire at Laconia Bike Week. And I gotta get closer, you can hear me. But before I do that, I wanna rewind to the drum head I had to put on the other day. I got your feedback for you, Mr. Rocket. You know what happens is, you take these bags, you count them out, you grab your photos there, and then you put them inside the sock. Then you take your lanyards and you put them over there, and make sure everything's pre-packaged and all. And then you get the album signed over there, but you've been kind enough to sign before everybody else. And then I take care of all the VIPs because that's what they are. They're very special, uh, important people to us. They should be called VSIPs. They're very special, important people. So there you go. What we're going to use today is an aquarium super kit. This is actually the batter side. Why would we use a batter side on the resonant side? Because we have a lot of overtones on that stage because it's a high SPL level. What that means on the super kick is it's got this piece of foam. Now the foam mo moves with this like one uh, unique membrane together um, and, uh, and that produces a nice thuddy sound. But we're going to put these on your united membrane. I've seen, I said some other word, but United member. What that does is it goes right on here like this. But what we need to do is use a little a drop it on in a spray bottle and then we're going to uh, apply it. I'm going to show you how we're going to do that. This is a matte finish on here. Brian Ryder from Ryder Graphics provided this. He does all my work like this. And uh, shout out to Brian. So, anyway, we're going to do it. Here we go. And did I hear you say you and me you here today to take you to this mansion in the sky? Oh, yeah. So the first thing we're going to do is do this. What we're doing is kind of trimming, cutting the size a little bit. This isn't tremendously difficult, but if you do, I do want everybody to see this. I like using water on here, so um, you basically just go for it. I swear to God, it's like when something's this big, you just put it on and start moving it around. So what I normally do is just do about half of it. Just a light mist, and then a little bit on the decal, too. Or as we say in Canada, decal. So, yeah. The little bit of liquid on here provides uh, the ability to move this around. And you want to push it on. Where's the uh, squeaky? He has I've got it here in my hand. And that is not correct. It's got to come this way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so no, no, this way. Come this way. No, we got it. There we go. And you can just see that juice coming out of there. Woo! He said juice. Nice. We're going to hit it with the blow dryer. The main thing is to get rid of all the bubbles underneath. Some kind of a hanky. I mean, a, a hanky? Not a hanky. Uh, paper towel. Paper towel. Just kind of. What do you think? I like it. I like the mat a lot. You like what? The mat a lot. Yeah. The finish. Yeah, you're just an ass kisser. Yeah, he is an ass kisser. Spidey's on the patch. How about the patch? <laughs> what does it say? So right. By doing this, the paint will adhere to it better, and it also allows the drum head with the flat uh, paint on it that you will not see it. It will actually blend into the head. Uh, Tango's over here drying the head. Let's have a look at that process. So the blow dryer finds the water. It'll bubble up, and when you find the bubbles, you just move it toward the edge and you feel it around the glue bead here. And then you stop it up, 
And then, yeah, once we get that out and let it dry, then we're good to go for the porthole. Yep. <laughs> This is how you do things at a venue, right, Rob? Exactly. We used to do it in a hotel room. I remember when you paid a whole drum kit in a hotel room. Last time we were able to stay at a holiday inn. The holes. We're going to put the holes in there. All right, so what we did was we put this, the, the, you have to put, all right, what it comes with. Okay. These guys here, Big Bang Distribution sells these. Um, and this is a chrome one when we painted it black as you saw here's the back part of it and a little bit of the stickies coming off and then you put that on the back side and then you cut around it and then you drop the front piece on which is this now that it's painted and that goes on like that all right so we're just trimming this up now see that plastic insert makes it easy to trim this adhesive is so strong that you really don't need to pop it down as hard as, as you think you do. And because of this paint, I'm just going to have to be a little bit careful. See, it just fits in there like a gasket. And what you have to do is you have to get a blunt object, like a screwdriver, and uh, put something padded like this here and I'm going to put plastic under it too uh, just because I don't want it to stick. I Tell that guy fuck you and see how it happens. Unplug the mic. Unplug the mic. with your hand. It's going right through the hole. Ah, there you go. Stick in the hole. Stick it all. Hang with the backstage home. This side actually is um, beveled. A four, it's beveled. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's got a bearing edge and this is round. Well. So that goes against. DW is one of the few companies that does that. Oh really? Oh yeah. Wait. It's less uh, surface area touching the hood. Back off. Which way? That way a little bit. Counterclockwise. Counter? Counter. Yeah, Counter. No, that's clockwise. That way is clockwise. Counterclockwise. Counterclockwise. Oh, the other way. There we go. Hold on, stop, back up, right let there. me see. That's working. Yeah, the Canadian look. Is that working? No, a little more. Yep, a little more. What? Hold on, guys. It's, going, it's going, going down like that. Oh, you're tripping hard. It's going down like that. What? It is. It is. Oh, your hand was. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. The, right. Then the artwork's off. The artwork's off. Gotta get order new ones. All right. Take care of each other and keep rock alive. And God bless you.